Okay, who am I playing as now? Luigi. Wait, is it Luigi Luigi or Luigi Mario? <laughs> it hasn't been confirmed if it's canon or not, but who knows if it will be. <laughs> hey guys, it's come here and well, back for more new Super Mario Bros. DS. And last time we finished World 1 and started on to World 2. And this time we're gonna try to finish up World 2 here. Here, so. Yeah, we don't have very much left in this world. Just two more levels in the castle. Oh. <laughs> Heck, if we want to, we could just go back and go straight to the castle. But we're not gonna do that. We're gonna go straight on into this here. Here, so. Let's just go through and we have the. So we've been having the here, Will. Every time a bar. Yeah, like that. <laughs> I didn't even mean to time it with the music there of the bar. Like there. Yeah, Will. Every time a bar goes. Why do I keep timing the music with me saying that? Yeah, every time a bar is said, they jump. Um, so, yeah, it's also every mute, every mute will uh, dance to the bar whenever, uh, whenever the bar is said. It's like that in all, new, all of the new Super Mario Bros. games, which I think it's a nice touch. <laughs> uh, yeah, but like, I guess not every Emni, like those Fire Emni, he's there, they don't, they don't really do it. Except for the fact that you can get sort of crushed by these guys with P block. Ah, come on. Okay, I still managed to get the Star Coin. And land right on top of that one. At least they don't get big. Oh, those fireballs and and the boomerang blow. Come on. Uh, yeah, just okay. Well, at least that that's there as so well. I can actually get through it, so I can get an item. Let's see what are we getting here today. A shell power. Up. Guess I could take that. Right, we'll have to. Should we, we just go for this star coin again? And by doing this and. No! Okay, good. Okay, that was the second one, and how did I manage to dodge that though? Oh, well, you know what? I actually killed him. That's fine, and oh, by the way. Go into quicksand and just jump right here and it's a secret in here. Here and the third star coin I think is down here. Here and yeah, it is. Just gotta wait for it. Might be. yeah, there it is. Just gotta wait for this thing to jump or that works too. But anyway, I guess one thing I could talk about here is yeah, so. If any of you did see that, that Mario Party video in the introduction here I made, because I thought of a way, way how to actually handle doing Mario Party Let's Plays, but it's not going to be as consistent as how I'm doing this. It's going to be like gradually out whenever I get the t t chance to. And how it works is, is going to be doing two 10 tone games, because I did because just to make it seem like we're doing a full 20 turn game just, just do two 10 turn games on each board right, and then just go and do all the side modes as much as I can co up and finish it off sing if there's not much left that left then I'll just finish it off by myself here it's just feels weird that um, that uh, you're moving with this thing and not just jumping things to Oh, right. Yeah, if you get what I'm saying, that is. Well, like, but nah, that's not important. Never mind. But now this part level is a little bit more harder, dude, because the piranha plants are surrounding us. And go to start going. Oh, come on again. See, like, ha ha. What do you mean? Hmm. Oh, man, well, that sucks there. 
Yeah. Uh, duh, how's, how many times has this thing gonna screw with me? And apparently not enough for me to who do this. Uh, this that is. <laughs> and yeah, and you know, also like, and also that Mario for your party introduction video, it had a custom thumbnail of all contestants that will be in it or have already have been. And well, which you know, I thought it would have turned out pretty good. Ba basically, what I did was I like, took a picture of like the Mario Party 8 title screen ring, and then just drew it like over it. When basically, and sort of the same thing I did for my the thumbnail on my Pokemon for gold finale. Well, let's play finale here. Here, well, I just took a picture of my character about to. Um, uh oh, battle red and before he sent out the first Pokemon and and um, then just drew me over it and just drew which I would like the construct which the idea for that got out of hand a little fast because at first I was just gonna draw like the character it was just me there and then I was like you know what I want to go a little more out out and more out in this and do like more detail like put in the background and such and. Just drew all around red there, just to make it look like he's still there. I didn't feel like it wanting to redraw him there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, tell that was in... Yeah, and just did the backgrounds too, which... Which in my idea was still just only putting the character there. Like... like which is what I did for the Sonic 4 episode 2 about the homing attack thumbnail. You know, but, yeah, there wasn't really anything special background I wanted to draw for that one. And so, yeah, that's why. Didn't really, just kept that one as the background the same. And, oh, by the way, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. You have to pump air into this thing and out goes the piranha plant. And it's a... When... Yeah, getting on top of the flag, the one up on top of the flagpole is kind of tricky in this game because you have to be like really up there, like either above it or diagonal of it. But they made it a little, lot more forgiving in like the light... They made it more forgiving in the later games. Games with to where you don't have to be like above it or diagonal above it. Vid, so that there was a there's something that they they change with. Let's keep in mind this was also the first new Super Mario Bros. game. For the Nintendo Come on, seriously? <laughs> so I got hit right away as soon as I got the item. <laughs> it's almost like the same thing I have with Sonic Free and Knuckles where every time I get like an elemental shield I would just like Lose it almost immediately. Wait, we can He's out of why. Maybe it's just a curse. Curse, but yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure. It's, but it's really still not important. It's not like it's prevent from dying from it or anything. Uh, for just getting hit immediately once I get the shield in that game. But, you know, whatever. But, but uh, yeah, but it, we now want to a second castle, and it's kind of creative about this castle is that part of it takes place like outside the castle, which I think is a creative touch. Which you don't, we don't really get that much for a castle, so it's really we will just go outside, do them, them outside the cast. Part of the stage takes place outside the castle. Duh. And you know, Fire Flower will take that in. And actually, do it's an interesting thing about uh, about this game, which I'm glad they never brought back, didn't bring back for any of the later ones. Where's the mini mushroom here? Which is gonna fit through those tiny gaps. And it also helps for getting the third star coin here, which is good. Heard it's a get back to normal size because yeah I, I would just prefer that and 
Now we're about to fight the boss. So let and I think that I think that's kinda of cool about this game is that they made it to each large castle boss is different. Which I just think is pretty cool which which the other games don't really new Super Mario we old games don't really do that. Yeah, so I and the mini castles are always Bowser Jr. but we haven't got they do change it up later on slightly to where you, a different way on how do you attack them. Duh, trying to do double damage and if I was fighting this boss with the mini mushroom whom it would be harder to do it because one hit and you're done and you tiny. And now I've come up here. Well, three and sign and there's a tiny gap underneath where that tiny gap is is how you can access world four. It's what, so how it works is you have to like you have to beat that boss with the mini mushroom uh, or using the mini mushroom and and would you go down that hole and into the or Mario depending on who you're playing as and you and then you just it would take you straight to world four. Which, you know, which is nice. So, two of the worlds are optional in this game to where you don't have to do them to 100% of them. Which, we will do World 4. But, but for, I'll, like, what I'll do is, like, off, I'll play through the stage, the, the large castle again off camera, just so we can unlock lock World 4. When, I'm glad the, that I, this idea you know, of accessing World 4 Oh, and you also use it to unlock World 7. Then, so, yeah, I'm glad they didn't reuse that idea. Because I just think that was a kind of annoying. annoying but, yeah, but yeah, it, yeah, for, it, I do think it was still a nice touch. And, and star, I think it's the first time getting this. This and the camera's out of shot though because I wasn't paying attention to it. And then pipe down here and leading to thinking that well, this is where the next star coin is and yeah there it is. Oh shoot. <laughs> I was wasn't paying attention because I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, so you just saw the screen top screen there. <laughs> By the way, if that fish is the back of eats you, you want it's done instant kill. Even if you're bigger, it's, it'll still eat you in one hit. Unless you have a Mega Mushroom or uh, a star. Uh, well, you can see him chase swimming. <clears throat> I don't think I'm getting this. Oh, well, never mind, I did. And almost gotten eaten, but. Oh, darn it! Okay, Oh, I done it. Pressed it, but uh, I feel like like it just sometimes don't get that off. Okay, there we go. Well, I got the one up, which is nice. Uh, hmm. So now instead of going on to next stage here and going up, we're going and get this. Extra level that we can buy with the star coins. And then, and yeah, you, you may notice that this stage we just played as well as this next one going to, it's on the shore, on the beach here, but there, it's not, there are no actual beach levels in world in, in this game, which actually the only game state levels that have a think level that has a has a beach a stage in it is when in world six which yeah kind of interesting but there's no ac actual beach levels they just add water in them don't seem to, with it's kind of with, with, with yeah no act which they do fix that for the later games where they actually include beaches and world less levels in world four like and when uh, yeah, so, you know, so that's, 
uh, something, but, you know, I don't mind it too much because as long as the stage is still fun to play to me, then that's fine. I, I don't mind, wouldn't mind if there were no beach levels in here, but it was just something that would be nice to have, you know. Okay, yeah. let's, let's get some coins. Logically, I could just ground pound this, but I would rather do it like that and get an extra fire flower. Oh, wait, it's the next star coin there. Oh, let's get that in. Oh, how convenient. Thank you very much for that. A water skitter. I mean, it's no sir skit because, yeah, it's not blue. Ooh, so, oh, that was that. Even though a surf skit was out at this time, but wow, I bounced off it while I was in the water. Okay, didn't think, didn't know that was a thing in this. This way. All right, something down here, which needs a mini, a mini pipe, which is a tiny pipe. So I need the mini mushroom to get in there. But is that where the star coin is? It is no, it's not up here. No, <laughs> we need the mini mushroom because it's the, or the mega mu mushroom because the mini mushroom also allows you to run across the water. But for the mega mushroom we could just easily jump up the, uh, up there and grab it. <laughs> so that would have made it easier but we, we the only Mega Mushroom we could have access to are the Mega Mushroom houses, which this one back at the start that we unlocked at the beginning, beginning of this LP, and a few Mega Mushroom houses that we haven't gone to yet. You know, who knows what? Cause that, most of the Star Coins of this game, they don't require a Mega Mushroom to get to. You know, let's just go here for the heck of it. Cause <laughs> that. There are quite a few that require the mini mushroom, which uh, that kind of annoys me. <laughs> but don't worry though, like if you want to hundred percent the game, game really. Because the thing I seem to notice a trend for several of these Mario games to well, well like some games are just great if you don't hundred percent them. Like Sunshine, get the blue co getting the blue coins in that game can be kind of annoying. Annoying, but. It is still a great game if you don't 100% it. It is. So where was, I guess, Super Mario 3D Land? Well, replaying all, all the special world stages. With, with this, uh, those special world stages I would like. If it wasn't for the fact that there were all, so many cosmic clones near the end. And then, especially when they get big, go near the end. And, and then, I would just... I wouldn't... Though, I, the big cosmic clones in Super Mario 3D Land, I wouldn't mind as much. If, much if the fa if it wasn't for the fa fact that they were too close to you. Because same distance as the normal size. I did keep forgetting that. So, which screams there and almost fell there. Yeah, but... Yeah, but yeah, if you make, ever played Super Mario 3D Land and... I actually played some of the later special worlds and and then you would understand what I'm saying. But yeah, and for some of the later stages, special world stages in Super Mario 3D Land are just kind of the same stages as the normal ones, but just added with twists added to them. <laughs> but yeah, that, even so, that the game's also a great game if you don't hundred percent it. It really, because. Ah, uh, come on. Uh, huh. Hmm. So, sleep here. Yeah, oh, wow. It looked like that box there just flew back here. Okay, I hope I did swap with the other one. And with this far without a check for, without a star coin. Logically, I should have used the blue shell that I got. Oh, which... I mean, this is no blue shell to from Mar the Mario Kart games to where uh, with the spikes on it, and and the used to be with the wings, but I think starting with seven they got rid of it. 
Mm, we got rid of the wings. But I could be wrong. I, we'll have to go back and play in seven, look in seven and see. Which is the best selling game on the Nintendo 3DS. Which, you know, I think it's cool to... Sorry. I think that's starting with the, yeah, starting with the 3DS and then going on to the Wii U and the Switch. It seems like they're best-selling game, game, uh, games on those consoles of the Mario Kart Switch trend that seem to started there. I don't know, but maybe that's just me and woohoo, secret exit. <laughs> because like best Mario Kart 7, best-selling 3DS game, Mario Kart 8, best-selling Wii U game, and. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe by selling Switch game games so but that trend might break pretty soon because Animal Crossing New Horizon those sales have just been like going like crazy oh I need a running start on to get up this oh that was the uh, final plant because yeah if you stand on top of the pipe with the piranha plants they won't come out of the pipes I just goes like I'm standing where one is right now and he's not coming out. You know, but if he's about to rise out, you you will get hit. Which you saw happen to me already. <laughs> you saw. I just, I just had an itch there. Oh. Yeah, it's a... Never mind, you don't want to. Just trying to find a pipe to go down. Oh, I think that um, you do need. I can't remember how to get that star coin. Maybe for the mega mushroom, because yeah, this is one of the stages where the, using the mega mushroom would not be the best thing to d do because mega mushroom can destroy pipes, but only certain ones. That is, <laughs> it's like the one I'm standing on right now. You can't destroy. And it won't destroy that block which is dividing the pipes or whenever it comes to a turn. And because, yeah, it wouldn't work that way. And stage is over already. <laughs> Went by quite fast. At least it felt like it did. Did so, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> And look at that, we're skipping the mini castle and going straight into the large. We'll, we'll go back and act, actually clear the stage the correct way. Maybe because we're gonna need it need to post the mini mushroom. I would have preferred the mega mushroom. <laughs> because you can get the mega mushroom from that. I, I don't. I've had it happen to me a couple times. I Means of course I could just go to a Mega Mushroom house and get a one up. Oh, <laughs> I said that because I just got one. And why is my nose all of a sudden itching me? All yeah, hey, when it, that just kills it, ruins a moment for you. Still getting the itch all on. Okay, I got it. Too well. So what's Continue on here and let me actually zoom out slight zoom out slightly. Cause I feel like I'm a little off the frame here. A little off focus here, even though yeah, I could just angle this down a little more or yeah, I'm off too far off to the side where it's not perfectly centered, but on the yeah, where it's in folk frame and where you in the camera shot here. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, if it's off, if the if the if the screen's a little off to the left or to the right, then that doesn't bother me too much. I didn't, I jumped too early. The idea is that uh, let those two drop and then let that platform I was on drop and yeah, actually, I grab those two red coins and then get the other two. I was one second away from getting that the bonus house. But it's okay, and I still have not used this blue shell yet. <laughs> and with, 
Where do you know? Well, I'm just saving it for when I need it. Yeah, so now into the mini castle. When cannon to you. See and four star coins now, so we gotta go back and let's climb this up. And just pressing B will will knock those them off and And now we gotta go back in the cannon to go up back up. Wait, yeah, yeah, cool. I call that is now on the other side. Wait, how did this switch? Kind of makes us think all oh, it's in slightly 3D, but not really. In fact, we need to be back on the other side in order to get that star going. I mean, so let's find one like. This and oh wait, on this will work. Here again, uh, no, I didn't have to go back around, which is good. And why did I jump into him? But I don't know why it's not important. But what is important is I clear the stage and get hit by another Koopa. Then, but no, uh, it's. Uh, um, I can't seem to. Okay, you know what? I'll just use the blow shell now. Because I'm making too many close calls here. Hey, I'm one of you get the Koopas now. <laughs> but, but that was the boss room. Do, 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 do. Okay, there we go. Oh, but. Actually, if. So, you know, of my. It's not up there. I was thinking that maybe I'm thinking of a Lado castle to whale the shit well Star Queen's above. Wow, I actually knocked him over that way. I wasn't even, I was just doing that for fun. And that's it for Bowser Jr. And off to the large castle. So, let's save and hmm. let's go on to the. So, we got one, two, three. We have, we have two normal stages a ghost house and a large, the large castle. And that'll be it for world three. And what we call it after that, uh, uh, probably. Also call it after that to so, yeah, a video after that so I can off screen game while going and try to get access to world four. And yeah, I'm good for the blue shell because now I can swim faster. <laughs> so it makes speed running the underwater stages funner. No, and just admit, no, can't go down. No, but. Green one, no. I can do it. Move away out of the way, blooper. Well, I, I was trying, it's like it was trying really hard for me to get hit. Come on. And well, we use that, that's what we use to get down here. Here and down there, you play no water blue shells down here, it just sucks. Uh, oh, come on, how did I not get that? But I got the other one uh, on the other corner. Hmm. It just seemed a little. No, okay, no, they just seemed a little suspicious to seeing that they were different color from the other green. But, yeah, well, this should lead to another star coin if I. Wait, no, or if I'm, I'm just, okay, yeah, there it is, and it was a, it was a booby trap, let's get out of here. If I get off him and go up the pipe. And miss the second star coin, but it's all right, no big deal. And 
and now we're coming up to our first ghost house, which is actually interesting thing to, to the map because, as well, if we, if, we, like on, if we go on the bottom screen here, it won't show like a map on how far we have left to go to the end. Instead, it will just show boo faces there saying, hey, hey, you don't have a map here to tell you how close you are to the end. And then, and yeah, we're, it operates like pretty much any other booze do. We'll look at the booze and they'll just cover their faces and not want to be you to look at them. And look away, they'll chase you. See you, so. Oh, yeah, that was that. Just, oh, and these pumpkins. Just, you step on them, they sound like they make an oddly but realistic skull crushing sound. Yeah, kind of creepy if you, if you think about it. Did, but yeah. No, not like I needed that firefly. Well, I already have one down below. <laughs> oh, as you, can, as you can see right there. Oh, yeah, right. uh, coins. I like coins. Give me all the coins, please. Oh, darn it. I, I should have waited for that platform to come back down. Okay, oh, wait. I'll wait for it to come back down and then press the button again. There we go. Huh, I was just checking to see what was up there. Phew, just barely made it up there for the star coin and can't sl uh, can't even jump out as I'm sliding. Dang, that sucks. Not even the jump, not even like if I can, if if it's like in an action movie where you're just jumping off something that's about to fall or on to. <laughs> if you, I don't know if you, you probably get what I mean. But anyway, what? Anyway, let's have to actually press that switch to get that door to appeal and rush your way there. Otherwise, you have to redo really the switch. So, let's, let's get this again. And why is my nose all so itchy all of this recording? And maybe it's, uh, this is the it's way I'm saying, hey, you shouldn't have done this later than usual. Yeah, I'm recording this a little later than usual. Which isn't in here a bad thing. Thing, but it's okay. But I guess so. Yeah, we... So now we just have one more stage and then the castle. So let's go back there, here this way, and get it. And so three dash C. <laughs> oh, come on! It was because the block was there. All right, okay, never mind. I take it back what I just said because it's a blue shell. Clear the whole stage while doing this. <laughs> but no, we're not actually doing that because we have to get the star coin in. Wait, but it's not, not like I'm gonna try to beat the whole game while only using the blue shell in this form, but a, there was a challenge video of someone doing that, which, you know, I saw it in a couple times and it's an interesting challenge idea, but mm, not one that is possible to beat the game with. But how about trying to beat the game with only using the Mega Mushroom? But, but how that would work is missing the pipe. Brilliant. Now by getting using a Mega Mushroom at the beginning of each stage and then making you as much progress as you can through with it. But and then... Now that's just a little too high up for me to reach. Reach, but oh well. Well, and then, like, as soon as the Mega Mushroom wheels off, go to. Oh, I'll, I'll get another Mega Mushroom, make your way back to that area, and then use the Mega Mushroom there. And if there's any low points where you can't use the Mega Mushroom, then I get that's on you to wheel. Oh, yeah. Well, you to wheel. 
then I proved you can't beat that stage and just continue on here. And yeah, so now we're in the, the castle here and just you go. Not gonna get that. I only have fire flower and just use the shell of you. Then. Do, 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 do. Mm. Use it. Okay, wait for that thing to come down. Now and then. Who? <laughs> Bombs can't get me. Darn it. <laughs> Hmm. Wait. Oh no. Hmm. Actually, I think I even know how, remember how to get that star coin. Only right now it's. Yeah, it's here. We'll swing on this rope. Jump, jump across. Just go up here. And yeah, the idea is that you're supposed to fall back down and go back, make your way back over. You think he would fall in the water and kill himself that way? Wait, but yeah, that, but it's not following real life physics always. Darn it. Okay, wait. I think we can get this one. Give it a try. Swim him away. Oh, well, I'm actually. Undo that. D darn it. <laughs> that that fucking game underneath threw me off guard. Let's go back and do it again. Yeah. Luckily, we've got the checkpoint. And then, try to be a little more careful. And these guys you can't kill just by ground pounding. You know, let's get that stalking coin and don't even bother with the third one at this point. Because... At this point, just try to make it through, not get hit anymore, so I can at least have some hit points going into the boss fight for, of the castle. Okay, there we go. So I just wanted to wait for him to fall down first. <laughs> Luckily, you can't just walk over that. <laughs> if you think about it, you think you would, but because on how small the gap is. Darn. But it's no problem. Usually, usually it was supposed to be an invisible block with a power up around here, but I think they started including it and starting with the next game they do that. And oh, it's in certain stages for this. Oh boy, this is giving again. Well, it's not the same thing. And it kind of sucks is that there were cheap cheeps flying by and that one went over me. Okay, no, it's... Okay, just one more hit and that thing's done. Gotcha. I wouldn't have... I could have tried ground pounding it, but that would have been harder to do because it's moving. Uh, kind of fast to where it's hard for me to see. Well, we're in world five. It's not right. We should be going to world world four next. Not five. But yeah. What I'll do is so we'll call it here, so next time when it's in off camera I'm gonna replay through the World Two castle just to unlock World Four and we'll do it next time on New Super Mario Bros. DS we shall do World Four. So I'll see you all next time for that.